Well, hello, and welcome back to The Sims 4. My name is Travis Peter, and this is episode 12. So for today's episode, we're going to be switching gears a little bit, as we do here on The Sims 4. Of course, this cast of my Sims 4 series is very massive, and there's a lot of different characters. And since there's just been a lot of plot happening in the last few episodes, I thought it would be nice to kind of spend a little bit of time with a character you've seen a little bit of, but haven't really spent that much time with. So we're going to spend the day with Bella Goth. Of course, Bella Goth is the queen of the Sims series. She's always around, always been part of this series since since uh, the very first Sims, back when she was married to Mortimer Goth and had, I think she just had Cassandra as a child. Of course, in this game, she had Cassandra Alexander and was married to Mortimer. Um, if you'll remember from, oh God, I don't know, was it the first episode or something like that? All of her family's dead. You know, that's what happens in The Sims. But yeah, we're going to spend some time with her. I, I love how vacant her expression is. Just like, she's just like, oh man, you'll never guess what I've just seen. Words cannot describe what I've just seen. Oh my God, I'll never forget. <laughs> It's only because, I don't know, I must have been messing around with something and I removed all of her moodlets. So that's the face of a person who is merely fine. Nothing but fine. Of course, this is her everyday attire. I am obsessed with the fact that this is just her everyday, that she wears this little red dress. It's great. Anyway, so I'm pressing play. Every time I press play, she always runs to go mourn her children, which is, you know, un yep, there she goes. She's going to go mourn Alexander. Um, I, I mean, I understand it. Of course, it's, I'm assuming, very, very sad to lose a child. I can't imagine how devastating. But when you're trying to control her to do the things you want to do, for heaven's sakes, Bella, it's annoying AF. Now, of course, Bella's role in the city, she is... Oh, there she's crying. I have to turn this down a little. <laughs> Just make it silent so it goes away. Ignore it, Travis. Uh, of course, she is the realtor of The Sims 4. So, you know, she helped Allison and Harry move into their place, as well as a number of the other Sims here. So she is, of course, familiar with, uh, with Harry and Allison and all them. And so, oh girl, now you're going to be sad this whole episode. It's hard for a sad sim to hang out with other people. Try pep talk. Okay, girl, where's the nearest mirror? You need an effing pep talk. Give yourself a pep talk. Stop it. But what she's actually going to do is she feels really bad. Of course, she heard the news. It's all over the news that Allison has been kidnapped. Kidnapped by A. And so Bella wants to make people, you know, she wants to cheer Harry up a little bit. She knows it must be difficult for him being in that house all by himself. So she's going to bake him some cookies. Isn't that super sweet? Bella, will you, okay, I just need her to, there she, oh, there we go. That didn't take long. Boy, you got over that right quick. Oh, she's, Ugh, girl. Can I just remove that moodlet? <laughs> Actually, I can, but I won't. I won't. Actually, what I do need to do, though, is... Where's her mailbox? Ugh. Of course, as I do, Phil needs world. Disable world need decay. There we go. Maybe she'll get happy at some point. How long does that moodlet last? Three hours? That's okay. It'll probably take her, like, 12 hours to bake the cookies. Okay, so... Well, let's see what kind of... Oh, she can make brownies, too. Other stuff she can't make. What the heck? I have to, like, actually get things? Where the heck do I even get things? Whatever. Okay, where's the nearest set of cookies? Peanut butter cookies. There we go. Go bake some cookies, Bella. Hmm. Oh, look at how sad she is. God, I love her house. Of course, this is downloaded. If you're curious as to where I download it, if you want to use it in your Sims 4 game, if you go at the very bottom of the links below, in the description below the video, <laughs> excuse me, I do have a link to my website, which has a, a list and links to all of the different custom content and things I've, I've used in this. So I did download this from the gallery. So if you go there, you can find out and you can have this Girl, I cheated so you're a master baker. How the fuck did you drop that egg? But yeah, you can um, 
get it from the gallery. It's super. I love, I love, love, love this house. Just like the landscaping and everything. I'm assuming this is a pool. I bet she could try to swim in it. Okay, how are them cookies coming along, girlfriend? Oh, they're good. Noom. Ooh. There's, like, grilled cheese that she just, like, bailed out on at some point. <laughs> clean that up, too. Can't you, like, clean that up while you're waiting for that to cook? I mean, how many times do you just, like, put cookies in the oven and then just stand there and wait for him? She also didn't use a pot holder. Girl, if you take a cookie... Okay, I just need to... Ooh, they're excellent quality. Harry's gonna love them. So, what the heck? <laughs> Why does she have six voodoo dolls? You know what? I think Bound to Cassandra Goth, I think that was when I was, like, killing her family. <laughs> Because, of course, you know, her family needed to be dead for it, the story. And so I think I was messing around with a lot of different stuff. <laughs> that's that's suspicious, Bella Jesus. <laughs> Although I do, I do want to point out that only one of them was bound. And it was bound to her daughter. So... <laughs> Okay, come on, Bella. Oh my god, that's taking forever. Well, once you're done with that, we're gonna travel. We're gonna go visit Harry. Ugh, I never remember what neighborhood anyone is in anymore. The next step, there's gonna be another new town when there's another... Another expansion, and... I love how Alice's nose is an option. <laughs> Girl, she is missing. Although I'm actually a little worried, to be honest, the way the game is. Like, she's not, like, completely deleted, obviously. She's just, I've just kind of removed her from the houses. So I'm worried that I'm going to be playing, and then all of a sudden Allison's just going to show up. Ooh, what the heck, Harry? He's just, that's kind of creepy, actually. Um, she's gonna... Oh, he's angry. Oh, is he going to come yell at her? Look at that stank face. Ooh. He's enraged, in fact. Oh, look at how bad she feels for him. <laughs> oh, Harry, real mature. Ooh, they're gonna end up fighting. She, you know what, Bella? Just, like, do him a favor. Like, clean this up throw that away like clearly he like knocked that over in a fit of anger oh my god she's just i mean i suppose like not a lot of time has passed in the game since i kind of speed things along here in the sims but so maybe where is she taking that there's a garbage right there you know what you're not his maid if you are gonna go inside because you've got to deliver the cookies at the very least Boy, this is just a riveting episode of The Sims 4. <laughs> but what's this? The inside of Harry's house has changed a little bit. Of course, he has been very disturbed about the disappearance of his, his longtime friend, Allison. That he's kind of become obsessed with... Oh, wait. I need to put the walls up so you get the full effect. There we go. But yeah, he's been he's been really obsessed with trying to find her, and it's kind of consumed his life, as you can probably see. I love this the stink face side eye that he is giving her right now. Like, what is this bitch doing here? What the fuck does she want? But yeah, I've, I've, he's completely cleared out the living room, gotten rid of everything, and kind of turned it into a headquarters for trying to track down a dun dun dun. So yeah, as as you can tell, he's got, um, I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. It's just like, you know, this is what I kind of think they might look like. But yeah, just a full on command center, just tons of papers and boxes and files. And it's just, it's a little obsessive. Although I kind of understand it, Harry. So personally, I forgive you. I also just can't be mad at you when you 
are in those adorable little yellow swim shorts. <laughs> The Sims recently have just been like when I ran like went to go play Bella, she was just in her evening gown, just for no reason whatsoever, just standing outside her house in an evening gown. The Sims, I feel like throughout like the updates and everything have gotten weirder and weirder with their clothing choices. <laughs> anyway, so she's gonna try to calm him down because he might oh he's like eating. Well that's good. Oh, he's a little <laughs> I love how he took a bite and he's like, hmm. Is it gonna work? Oh, there we go. That's good. Now brighten this day a little bit too, Bella. See, now he's got a nice, nice plate of food. Oh, there we go. Now they're laughing. See. You know, she's like, you're on a good path here, Harry. You'll figure it out. I have faith in you. You know, you're going to you're gonna figure out who took Allison. You're going to get her back. And all this is going to be behind you. And you have your wonderful wedding to Louis to look forward to. Oh, okay. And there's the cookies. See? Call to meal. Everybody have some cookies. They're excellent quality, Harry. You'll love them. What's he eating? Eggs and toast? Have a cookie, Harry. Rude. She brought these all the way over here so you could join her. Oh, well, he did just have breakfast. So she's going to have a deep conversation with him. Just be like, you know, how have you been doing, Harry? How has your life been going? What the heck? That sounded so accusatory. <laughs> oh, misunderstanding. Wait, she just has the sassiest expressions. I'm actually having a lot of fun playing with Bella. <laughs> okay. And, God, it's taking her, like, 20 years to eat that cookie. You know how long it takes me to eat a cookie? Faster than I even realized that it happened. What the hell was that? <laughs> Sounds like he's telling a very suggestive joke. But it's good to see him in good spirits, isn't it? Oh my god. Look at who's a suspect in the A case. A cat and a dog. And that looks like, um, what's his name? Tyler Hoechlin? Is that his name? He's from Teen Wolf. Let me know in the comments if you watch Teen Wolf. I haven't watched the newest season yet, so no spoilers, but... Uh, what's his character's name? I don't even remember. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's the one werewolf who... Not Tyler Posey, but the other one. <laughs> anyway... You know what, Bella has been having a great time, so she's going to go, you know, she's in good spirits, and she has been kind of, like, sticking around the house and everything, so she wants to go out. So she's going to give him a hug goodbye. Oh, what is she? She's just telling him an awful, awful story. I can't give him a hug? Okay, just tell him goodbye then. Friendly. Goodbye. Tell him goodbye. We're going out, girlfriend. It's 847, the sun is going down, and so are her panties. Oh my god, I hate myself. I would like to apologize for that. Did she say goodbye? I'm not paying attention. Okay, she must have said goodbye. Get out of there, this is awkward. You say goodbye, just awkwardly stand there. I love how they do stop talking. They just do do do. At least he's got... Okay, no wonder you're not finding a Harry. You just sit here and play Blick Block. <laughs> okay, go here, Bella. And make haste. Okay. So, let me pause it for a second. We need to get you decked out because we're going out. Oh, yeah, I want the world to know. Ooh, I better not sing too much of that. Otherwise, I'll get a copyright ding on this video. Change outfit. What does her party wear look like? Oh, that's cute. 
It's always a red dress, always a tight red dress. At least she's like knows her style. She knows her brand. Change outfit, formal. <laughs> That's a little too formal, Bella. She has a career? What the hell is that? <laughs> She's an astronaut, I guess. Um, ugh, sorry, I apologize. This is boring, I know. Okay, girl, here we go. We're going out. Put on your dancing shoes. Where should we go? Oh, let's go to Windenburg. There's, I don't think I've ever been to the, the club there, right? Have I? No, just by yourself. Harry needs to stay home and solve that fucking mystery. I'm really glad that she was able to kind of calm him down a little bit, though. He was just stomping around, obsessed with the case. And she, you know, brought him some cookies. And who doesn't feel great? Okay, excuse me a second. <laughs> Dang it. Um, God. Okay. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Because I haven't, like, 100% deleted, deleted Allison, she is randomly going to... She might randomly appear places. So we're just going to get rid of her. What? No. Leave. Allison, you're not supposed to be here. You're kidnapped. Oh, maybe she's about to disappear. Anyway, imagine she's not here. Is anyone at Le Discotheque? Okay, can I really not get rid of her? Okay, so it's like she's not there. <laughs> Who's here? Literally no one. Okay. Well, who are these people? There's, like, people here I've never seen, but I think there's a lot of, like, strangers. What's she doing? Oh, she just wants to go watch the DJ. That's not what you do at a disco. A le discothèque. You dance. Everybody dance. Oh, and there's a downstairs one, too. The thing about these is, like, there's always never enough bartenders. Oh, I think I've hired her for parties before. Well, let's order a drink. Let's order our favorite drink. I wonder what her favorite drink is. You know, might as well get get all uh... <laughs> what a terrible song. <laughs> um, I want to say lubricated into the evening. Well, and I just did. Okay, there it is. I said it. Oh! <gasps> Ghost Travis is here. That's so great. Let's be friends with Ghost Travis. Oh, I guess she's not going to... Oh, she's going to wait for a drink. Yeah, these are all random people. All women, too. This must be like a woman's bar, but... Little gay Travis gets to come, too. <laughs> Ugh, Allison, go away. <laughs> You're kidnapped. Wait, how did I do it before? Just to get her abducted by aliens. <laughs> okay, bye. There we go. Now she's gone. Can they dance together? Let's have a dance battle. There we go. I hope that doesn't, like, make them to stop being friends. I feel like I'm shouting because this is so loud in my ears right now. <laughs> Here we go, people. Oh, she is fucking ready to lay down. Did you see that side eye she just gave him? Okay. Here we go. Dance battle. Dance battle. Oh, what a lame song to dance to. I love this, like, smooth, easy listening we've got going on here. <laughs> Just... <laughs> yeah, suck that. Suck it, Travis. I love... He must not know how to dance. He just kind of, like... Maybe ghosts can't dance? I don't know. 
Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's how I do in real life, though. Oh, heck yeah. Ooh, and a backflip. So, you could say, ooh, and he's pulled out some, like, LED poi. You could, you could say that. Ghost Sim Travis is very, very much like real life Travis Peter. Oh, and he threw his back out. He's very much like real life Travis Peter. Can we... Okay. I can't like change the song. Can I like request a genre? There we go. Break beats. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Let's get this party started. Oh my god, I bet my drink is, like, ready. <gasps> sorry, sorry, this is r so rude of me. What is it? A, ze a zebra fizz. You better hurry up, Belle. It's gonna be spoiled in eight hours. There we go. You know, you had some dance fun. Let's have a little conversation with good old bartender. Let's be funny with her. Ooh, love. Oh, she has a party animal aspiration. Oh, she's gonna, like, get that. No problem. She's just out and about. Let's discuss world peace. She's had from some drinks, and she's just like, you know what's, like, really great? Like, like I just wish so we can have world peace, you know? Like, like, what if, like, everybody was just, like, nice? Like, so nice. Like, all I want is for people to be nice, you know? So, in this way, Bella, Sims Bella, is very much like Travis, real-life Travis Bella. <laughs> because, you know, I get drunk. I just want to discuss world peace. I just want to talk all about that world peace. I also like to boast about my family. Let's not do that. That's kind of sad. I don't want her, she's having such a good time. I don't want her to like bring herself down by like talking about her family. Ugh, killing her family was the worst decision I ever made. Now there's a sentence that you probably never thought I'd, I'd say. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. It's really cool how you can see over the edge here down onto the dance floor. Also, like, why? It's, I mean, it's like one in the morning. Where is everybody? This club should be bumping. Like, there should be like 20 different people. What, the, what does this mean? What does that little thing mean? Can I join them? I want one of those. <laughs> Show off moves. Bella, don't be a loser. Get over here. <laughs> She's just like, <laughs> I'm just having a party to myself. Wait, how come now? Ooh! Now, dance. And she's going to go stand by herself. Dance with everyone. Dance. There we go. Dance on the dance floor. Maybe that'll be different. Can they do a group dance? Add to group. Group dance. One, two, step in. She's not the greatest, so... Not as experienced as Travis is, that's for sure. Okay, you ready? Are you ready? Are there people downstairs? No, there's like not even a DJ down there. No wonder people aren't showing up. Ah. There we go. Oh, heck yeah. Here we go. Girl, get out of the way. We're going to run into you. <laughs> Oh, she reached level two of the dancing skill. Oh, somebody new showed up. Although that looks like she's dressed to be a mixologist. Oh, there's more people here. Dominic Fries. You know, she's had a few drinks. Let's start flirting with Dominic. <laughs> oh, big Tash. Q. 
kiss hands. Ooh, oh, he is not receptive to that. How embarrassing. Girl, gotta warm him up a little bit at least. <laughs> Did she just say goodbye to him? Oh, it's to somebody else. Um, brighten his day. Ask if single, I suppose. He's not wearing a wedding ring. New people show up? Connor Burt is here, whoever that is. Nobody's downstairs still. Oh, he's married. Oh my god, Bella, you are flirting with a married man. Why don't you flirt with her instead? Offer her a rose. <laughs> you're single now, even though it's, your whole family died. Oh, there we go. Oh, she's part of Party House. I think that's a group, right? Like, that they just love to party? And they live in a house. Find out if she's single. She is single. Let's just go for it. Embrace. Oh, it's working. Oh my gosh, we're getting it. We're getting it. Flirt. Oh, did she just leave? I mean, I guess it is 3.30 in the morning, but girl, come on. Oh, Bella has to go to the bathroom really bad. I haven't been cheating needs. And there's no... Uh... Oh, what's she doing? Oh, she's like taking a long time to say goodbye. I think she's trying to get Bella to go home with her. <laughs> she's like, um, Bella, I'm leaving. I'm going to my house. I love that that's an elder. <laughs> oh, you know what this kind of looks like to me? It's that he left the wife at home to meet up with his his side dude. I've seen people just like you on Grinder. <laughs> there are young people that watch this. Oh, and Belle's on the toilet. Sitting on the toilet. Sitting on the toilet. <laughs> Um, you can change other people's outfits. That's so funny. I love how it's just them. Bella, I think it's just time to go home. <laughs> this is kind of a bust. Like, it was kind of fun. You got to hang out with Travis a little bit, but let's be real. Let's be real. Tonight was kind of a failure. By all means, Bella, take your time. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh, there's like a porta bathroom there. Do 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 do. <laughs> oh, brother. Was this a good episode? <laughs> sometimes I end an episode and I feel really great about it. And then sometimes I end an episode and I'm just like, what just happened? Girl. Can you have ice cream? Have some chips. When I come home after a night of drinking, I just like to sit and eat chips. Although she doesn't have a television, I just realized. That's okay. She's too sophisticated for that. And she put her chips in a bowl. Man, she is classy. <laughs> I just have the Doritos bag right on my lap. <laughs> yeah, anyway. On that note... Bitch is crazy. She's talking to her children. <laughs> yes, on that note, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. Make sure you like this video and click subscribe. I think after this episode, there's only four more episodes until the season finale. And of course, the big A reveal. Oh my god, isn't that exciting? Let me know down in the comments um, what sort of... What sort of things... Okay, I know some of you are underage. And so I'm going to assume that you guys don't go out drinking. Because you should only do it if you're of age. But what... Okay, if you are of age, what do you like to drink... What do you like to eat when you come home after a night of drinking? 
if you are not of age, what's just a really, did you see something fly by? Did you see that? <laughs> anyway, what's something that you, what's like it's something that's happened like that, like just when you wanted to have a fun night out, but it just did not turn out the way you wanted it to? Like what, just tell me about that. <laughs> anyway, this video is too long already. Let's just slowly zoom in onto the empty chip bowl. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Bye.